morning tonight from a Weber County woman who received a letter and a check in the mail, attempting to scam her out of nearly $2,000. ABC4's Rosie Nguyen explains how she caught the red flags and what you can do to protect yourself. A pleasant surprise Tuesday afternoon for this woman who requested to remain unidentified. She received a check for $2,300 in the mail and a letter saying she had been selected to be a mystery shopper. I would have been way excited had I been able to shop and get paid, and I think that's every girl's dream. The letter instructs her to deposit the check into her bank account, use the funds to purchase four gift cards totaling $1,900, and then sending them pictures of the card numbers. Real specific dollar amounts, and then they're asking you to do really, really specific things, like taking clear pictures of these cards, their numbers. As she read the letter, she started to notice there were some things that didn't add up. Everything is bounces back and forth across the country. The package, addressed from Pennsylvania. The check, supposedly issued from a bank in Texas. And the number in the letter, a Washington state area code. Where it's a lot harder to catch somebody or to find somebody when everything is different. Luckily, she and her husband searched online and looked up the company before taking any action. There's quite a bit of information online about the scam, and then you start reading the little snippets of all the different people who have been scammed. Now she's sharing what happened because I don't want anybody else to have this happen to them if at all possible. Reporting in Weber County, Rosie Nguyen, ABC4 News. Consumer experts say it can take banks weeks to inform someone that a check was no good and then make you pay the money back. By then, it's already too late. The scammers have taken off with the money.